I love the drunks grew up around them. I'm 100% Irish and upset. The point is, you're not like these people down at the beach. These people who exercise at the beach, have you seen these idiots? Huh? I go down there to relax, eat some bad food, and get sunburned. What's with the exercise? I'm down there a couple weeks ago. I'm taking a walk, minding my own business like I always do. Just going to get a snack because the one I'm eating is almost done. And out of nowhere come the rollerbladers. Every 20 seconds, the rollerbladers are screaming at me to get out of the way. Right? After about half an hour of this, I snapped. I was surrounded. All I was hearing, on your right! On your left! As I can't. Back off, Chumbly. There's only corn dog for one of us. Get away from me. Oh, man, I started out cranky. I'm sorry. Let me back up a little bit. I don't mean to take it out on you people. Just I work hard for a living. Unlike most of you, I've been up since 4.30 this afternoon. And... It's been a long day. It's not all bad, though. I just celebrated my four-year wedding anniversary. So that was kind of cool. She's not here. Relax. No need to impress her. She's not here. It's going good for all you guys thinking about making the jump. Some of you might be engaged as we speak. I just want you to know the truth. I'm very happy that she let me out tonight. Uh, <laughs> thought I was having a good night, got all dressed. I said, hun, how do I look? I dressed in black, it makes me look thin. Her response was, get over yourself, son. Black can only do so much. <laughs> That's nice. That's the support you want. Then they wonder why we don't listen. huh? You guys are always wondering why the guys don't listen. It's because of that kind of crap. And you tell us stuff at the wrong time. Just, just get us at the right time. Not when I'm in the recliner, the game's on, I got snacks and a cold one. Don't come in from the left with a nag. Week after week, it's over here. Oh, there's always a new project, isn't there? Always something else we gotta do. Can I have a weekend without a project? Is that too much to ask? Oh, I think we need new wallpaper. Then we can get some carpet to match it. It'll be really nice. And some bookshelves. We really should wind up with books. You know, we really need a bigger apartment. Maybe I can get my own little office. I want a dog. Aren't oh, those dogs cute we see all the time? It's like, oh my God, stop. And what you women don't understand is we don't even hear it. You're over here with a nagging, and this is what the guy hears. I'm cluing you all in. What is that? Ah, what is that? We don't hear you. We're sorry. We suck at it, okay? And, and you hit us with the big stuff? She hits me with, I've decided I'm a vegetarian. I'm like, what? Well, good for you. She goes, no, the whole house is vegetarian. I'm like, no, 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 no. Look, people, look, we have a problem. I can't be a vegetarian. She goes, no, it's gonna be really good, it'll be fun. I'm like, don't tell me that. I can handle anything, just don't tell me you're a vegetarian. Tell me you're a lesbian, that I can handle. <laughs> Bring your friend over, I'll get the camera, we'll all have fun, it'll work out. Don't tell me you're a vegetarian, you're scaring me now. She wants me to eat all that crazy crap everybody eats out here, the sushi and the tofu, never understood sushi. Raw fish wrapped in seaweed? What, what am I, in a show at SeaWorld? Why would I do that? <laughs> and tofu? How about to cheese? That's what it looks like. I'm sorry I said it, but it's disgusting, people. Get real. Sushi tofu. I have a new rule. If it ends in a vowel, I'm not eating it. <laughs> well, you know, this is pizza. <laughs> All right, Doritos, Oreos, a few things. <laughs> we'll bend the rules for just a few things. And the Taibo. Anybody into the Tybo? Go next! Tybo! Tybo! Let's get into Tybo! I love the Tybo! I'm like, okay, first of all, you're jumping around way too much already. Is there anybody by applause who's into the Tybo? Be honest, come on. I saw you walking in all full of yourself. Tybo, man, it's the new thing. You know what I said to her? Okay, I have my 20 minute workout. It's called toweling off after a shower. Right? It's that simple. By the time I'm done, folks, I need another shower. It's not pretty, okay? But it's my workout. I keep it to myself. She's always get the great ideas for me losing weight. Last birthday, she bought me this book trying to motivate me. It's called No More Negative Thoughts, so I read it. <laughs> Thought it sucked. <laughs> it's not gonna work, it's gonna take more than that. And then she goes, you know, you should try this new drug uh, that all the actresses are using to lose weight. I said, what, heroin? No, <laughs> I'll pass, thank you. She goes, no, no, that other thing, the, uh, the Zenical, I go, Zenical? Have you guys heard these Zenical commercials? They're 30 second commercials, 29 seconds of friggin' side effects. I was like, the side effects of Zenical may be an oily discharge. You'll feel an urgency for bowel movements and inability to control them. I'm like, who would buy this stuff? What does he come with a box of depends? What is this Zenical? It's disgusting. I'm not using that. Well, all right, I 
like spam, I said it. Alright? <laughs> I love spam. There, that was us. So what do you think about that, huh? I'm honest. <laughs> Drugs are nuts. You're not buying spam. What is that stuff? I'm like, I like it. I grew up on it. I'm eating it. She's like, oh, you're eating the spam again? I said, hey, look, we all have our sicknesses, all right? I eat spam, you watch Oprah back off. <laughs> back to your corner. God, I do love her, though, believe it or not. Because, you know, she's paying the rent right now. But the point is... <laughs> the point is, folks... And her parents are coming to visit again in a couple weeks. Oh. Wasn't that fun last year? <laughs> my mother-in-law's name is Connie, which we all know is short for constantly on my ass. <laughs> what do you do when they come out from the East? Bring them to Universal. Why? Not because it's fun, because it kills the whole day. Yeah. <laughs> Send them on the rides, you sit it out because you've done it a thousand times. Hope they have fun. What kind of a theme park is Universal? The longest ride is that three-story escalator down to the bottom of the park. <laughs> Spend the whole day on that. I started out at breakfast. By the time I get to the bottom, I'm looking for dinner. I'm like, that's it's just too damn long. My, and my mother-in-law, God bless her, please. We're going down the escalator, and she looks down at one of those big Universal sound stages where they film the movies. Forty-foot billboard there, advertising Schindler's List, seven Academy Awards. Right? You got a big giant sign. Underneath it is like 200 people waiting for some ride. And because it's the summer, they have that mist they shoot on you. So she sees the sign, the 200 people, and the mist coming on and goes, Oh, this must be Schindler's List, The Rye. <laughs> That's nice. That's nice. Oh, yeah. Say it a little louder, Connie. Oh, there's no Jews in Hollywood. Speak up. <laughs> Schindler's List, The Rye. Yeah, it's the last ride of the day, Connie. Leave your clothes at the gate. Hop on board. Yahoo! You guys have been great. That's my time. Thank you very much.